guys, welcome to Beer 30. I'm Greg. With me is Josh and Josh. Hey guys. Hey, hey Greg. Greg. Yeah, I'm already drinking a full beer here. It kind of looks beer weird. Hair. Beer hair! Yeah, I can't believe that. Um, Pace yourself. I know. Alcoholic. Today we've got uh, something you brought us. You want to yeah. tell us a little something about it? It's, uh, it's from Mother's Brewing. It's the renamed MILF. It is now called Mater Familias. Mater Familias. Now, what what does that mean? Is that is that I don't know. is that Familia like, uh, is family in Spanish? Well, right? I was gonna say, is that Spanish for milf? <laughs> <laughs> Could be. Probably mother's family, if I had to guess. That's what I, I was thinking. I yeah. don't know. Mater. Mater. I don't know. Mm. Uh, we'll so it's a barrel some... aged imperial stout, right? We'll uh, probably get some hate comments because we don't know what it means. Did you did you see that? Some. No. On our. Uh, did we get a, we had a couple hate, hate comments. comments? People calling us names, idiots, and really other stuff because we uh, we expected the uh, Budweiser. What was that one called with the the staves? Oh, you know what? If you talk down about anything Budweiser, they yeah. have their uh, little people go out and <laughs> do they really? They they put comment comments out and no way. No, I don't I don't know about that, but there's. There's a lot of... Was it the copper-aged or copper... The, the barrel-aged one? Yeah. The, the no, it was, was the awful. Jim Beam one. The Jim Beam. Yeah. yeah. It was awful. And we, we said something along the lines of, oh, I don't pick up any whiskey flavor. Or, yeah. And they're like, you guys are idiots. And there was like multiple comments. It's not supposed to taste like that anyway. You guys are idiots. Wow. Yeah. Uh, I just told them to have a nice day. <laughs> Well, this man, smells this, like whiskey. Yeah. This is <laughs> this them. smells really good. This smells delicious. It does. So uh, yeah. Oh, 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 oh yeah. Eleven percent. Eleven percent. Yeah. Hmm. Um, do we have more info on this? Let's see. Yeah. It, uh, sorry, kids. Nothing. It's a very, nothing. very even, very run of the mill. But God, it's good. In 2019, the beer we've called MILF will henceforth be known as, what, how do I pronounce that again? Mater Familias? Mater Familias. Mater Familias. Copy and paste it into Google Translate and see what it's happens. It's Latin for female oh, head of the house. There you go. Huh. Look at that. Uh, this coveted beer, blah, 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 why would we make such a drastic change to a brand that has been consistent winner over the course of seven years? Original name was based on a joke that likely needs no explanation. When we were fledging, when we were fledging brewery, mill fit in with the irreverent stance we were introducing ourselves with. Over time, we've come to realize that what first seemed cheeky and funny no longer fits us or the beer. So, they so what was they the, probably had some complaints. They've had some complaints. That, that, that term, yeah. They so, still all their brewers are like, "This is hilarious," you know. So yeah, probably. I mean, I whatever. What is the original mill? Um, I mean, it's not it's a barrel. It's not a barrel. Yeah. Eight. It's the same thing. Oh, it is. It's this beer. Oh, is, they just changed the name. Okay. Yeah. I don't remember it being this strong. When we were down in Springfield last time, we had th we had a chance to try their rum barrel aged mm -hmm. milk. And holy crap! Good, that was huh? good. <laughs> that was ridiculously good. I was hoping they would have more information about it, but it doesn't look like. I know we've had it before, and I just don't remember it being this strong. Well, I know oh. if you go to if you go to our beers, and then scroll down to specials. Keep going. Special release, Mr. Pumpkin. Oh, there it is. Oh, I was on a blog. Yeah, you something. were on a like a press release page. Uh, yeah, eleven percent, uh, rich dark chocolate, barrel tannin, and spirit alcohol, sugar cane, and nougat. Oh, that's we. I found. I found a bottle of KBS in my fridge last weekend, and Annette and I drank it. This reminds me a lot of that KBS. Very, very whiskey heavy. Yeah. That you, you do definitely taste the alcohol mm -hmm. flavor in it, but just a really good stout. Hmm. Well, this is good. I um, I don't. I think it's a little. So. It doesn't have the sweetness that I would, you know, associate with. And I think that's what their adjunct flavors are for. Yeah, it do, it's not as sweet as a normal high gravity. Do they still use that anymore? Do they I still don't say know. high gravity? I haven't heard that in a while. I like it. Yeah, it's good. 
Um, it only comes in four packs. How much was a four pack? I don't know. I didn't buy it in that. Uh, so what kind of bitterness? Does my this guess have? would be nine dollars for a four pack. If I had to guess, I did not see it on there, Josh. Uh, it's probably not on there. It's maybe really low. Hmm. Now, to me, this kind of almost dries out my mouth. because the alcohol. Oh, That's okay. what I'm saying. It's like it, I think it. I think it actually smells a little bit better than it tastes. I was going to say that. Yeah. I think it. I think it kind of has that mediciney, rubbery oh, alcohol no, no, no. taste. It's not that bad. No, I, I I think it has a decent flavor, but yeah, I I agree. Like whenever I I think when I smelled you, it, I was like, it has a really great aroma, but the taste is I don't know. I I think it. it's very okay. It's very alcohol heavy. I'm gonna say it's bland. That's it what is, I'm gonna it say. It's very middle of the road. I I, agree. I um, not my favorite barrel aged. Um, hey, now he's never gonna bring us any beer ever again. Whatever. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Screw you. <laughs> I know. I I guess I gotta say that. Thank you, <laughs> thank you for bringing. See this. if I share my double shot with you. Mm. Okay. I really like it. Yeah. Um, for me, it's B B minus. I agree. Uh, I say it's an A minus. I'm. Uh, it's not my favorite as far as this style goes, but it's not. Yeah. I think it's very similar to the KBS. If you like KBS, you'll probably like this. I think KBS is a lot better. I'm, I'm going to have to say that. Well, what you can do is bring us some KBS I don't and have this. Any more. That, I just happened to find a bottle well, of How are we going to compare them? How are we going to compare them? When is KBS released? Um, I don't know. Probably <laughs> next month or something. Probably. Really? <laughs> uh, we'll look that up, but uh, yeah. check out our other videos on... I'm sure we've reviewed KBS before. Yeah, we did, we did last year, I think. Uh, check out our other videos. Um, go to our website, beer30.tv, or check us out on YouTube, Beer30TV. We'll see you next time.